People depend on propane every day for heat, cooking, or power for their homes and businesses. Many of these customers get propane delivered by specially outfitted trucks with meters that measure the quantity being delivered. But how do customers know the meter is accurate? Well, that's where the weights and measures inspectors come in. They make sure customers get what they pay for and they get it safely. They do this with a special piece of equipment called a prover, a device that's calibrated in a metrology lab so the inspector can be confident it gives accurate readings of just how much propane is coming from the meter. The same process is used to check the meters on dispensers for grill cylinders and other tanks. When measuring the product, inspectors adjust for the liquid's temperature, which can influence readings shown in the prover. Inspectors use a liquid volume correction table to adjust their readings. Once all of this is done, the inspector can determine the accuracy of the meter. If the reading on the meter and the prover match up, the inspector leaves a seal of approval on the register and seals the meter. If the readings are not within a predetermined range of tolerance, the inspector may be able to calibrate the meter so it's correct, or it might have to be taken out of service so a licensed technician can adjust it. In some communities, weights and measures inspectors are also responsible for keeping delivery trucks themselves safe and in compliance. Truck inspection includes a variety of checks to ensure the delivery hose is in good shape and emergency shutdown devices are operational. This is for the safety of the driver as well as the customers. When consumers purchase the propane they need for their homes or businesses, they deserve to be confident they're getting what they pay for. By making sure propane distributors are making accurate deliveries, weights and measures inspectors make a difference every day. For more information, contact the National Conference on Weights and Measures at www.ncwm.com or your local Weights and Measures office.